video is gonna be a trip uh, through British Columbia from Calgary, Alberta. We're gonna head out to uh, Jasper uh, National Park first and that's where through glacier uh, ice fields and we will stay just uh, outside of Jasper. After that uh, there's no major planning as the trip was supposed to be totally different. Uh, original uh, trip was planned to be uh, for California and then uh, COVID uh, hit the world and we had to abort that. And after that uh, we were hoping to go to north towards Yukon which uh, also not possible because uh, Yukon does not allow any other people from different provinces and, uh, because of their COVID uh, numbers are non-existent pretty much. We're gonna plan as we go so uh, all we know for now we're gonna cruise uh, through British Columbia and that is the northern British Columbia and then we're gonna go to Vancouver and uh, through Whistler and after that we're gonna hit the Okanagan that uh, we're gonna head out to uh, Kootenays uh, I invite you to join me on this trip and if you like the content make sure to subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell to stay updated when I release the new content you can always comment below uh, they always appreciate it and uh, I'll try to answer all of them uh, join me on this uh, beautiful trip so I will be meeting a couple guys here um, in about an hour on Trans Canada Highway. Uh, we should be meeting there at uh, seven o'clock. A few floods uh, happening in British Columbia in the Kootenay area. All right, so we have joined together at the gas station uh, on Trans Canada Highway, and uh, now we are approaching. At our Rocky Mountain, so we're heading now for coffee, most likely to Lake Louise, uh, Bronze National Park, and from after the coffee, we're gonna head out to Jasper, Alberta. So we're approaching uh, the town of Banff in Banff National Park. Uh, if you haven't uh, been in this area, or in this town and uh, all the surrounded place, surrounding places. I really recommend visiting this uh, jam in the Canadian Rockies. So we made it to the first pit stop. pit stop at Lake Louise ski area or Lake Louise village I should say and now we are heading to Jasper and uh, the I Columbia ice field it looks like from Lake Louise to Jasper we have uh, 230 kilometers So, a tym bardziej, że jesteś out of province. Seems like a fresh snow on the ground, mixed with the old stuff. We're hoping that's not gonna turn into a snowstorm.
Saskatchewan River. On the way to just It's awesome. Awesome. The view is very awesome. nice. Great glacier. How are <laughs> How are we doing boys today? Very good, very good. A bit a bit on the chilly side? A bit? <laughs> You're being generous. <laughs> I'm being very generous always. I'm surprised that they actually have it closed, eh? No big trucks. There's a change of plan. We're heading to Pyramid Lake now. Plan on a go. Twisties. Vroom, vroom, vroom. And the water is gonna be probably about five degrees. Oh, there they are. Spectacular as it should be. Patricia, okay. Patricia sounds good too. Przed chwilą nagrywał. Nagrywał, nie? To jak wskakuj, zobaczymy czy to jest waterproof. <laughs> nice hands there, man. <laughs> so we have a right for a spot for a night. This is gonna be our home for tonight. Nie, to, to było ten, cenzura. Zobaczcie, możemy tak, pojechać tutaj. A ja nie wiem. Another day of riding.
It's beautiful here. Well, it's a picnic table, but we cannot stay over there. This must be a private spot. Let's see how we're going to do this. We're doing boys on a night two setup. That's our spot for a second night. And where are we, by the way, guys? On the lake, yeah. Huh? Green Lake in uh, British Columbia. It doesn't look green to be honest, but they call it a green lake. The sunset is on its way. And then I got it. Morning, everyone. This is day three of the adventure. We had a really good night of sleep uh, on the lake. Um, and uh, we were lucky enough that uh, one of the rangers uh, joined us uh, to stay and party till uh, almost midnight, having some drinks and uh, hood. Um, the night was way warmer. And nice bath in the lake first thing in the morning. That feels great, all refreshed. And uh, we are ready for another day full of adventure. Let's see what it will bring. Well, getting that lake is actually stretching quite a bit. Gorgeous area and the weather is on our side for now. A bit of rain yesterday here, but uh, nothing really to be worried about. And we arrived here, it was nice and sunny, full moon at night. Usually the further south we get, the, the warmer it gets also. We're, we're probably only about uh, 400 kilometers east from the Pacific Ocean. Right now that's a good time to be in here, even though it is a bit cooler. But uh, later everything will turn yellow because it's, uh, it's getting hot in here on uh, summer months and uh, all the grass is uh, burned out from the sun and right now all the, all the, all the green colors are popping and uh, it's beautiful and the weather is on our side This guy here, Mark is starting to cook. I'm a Viking. Yeah. <laughs> That's hard, man. That's hard. My gold. Whatever you throw. If you want to take grab it on, I'm gonna go to the tent. It's uh, Juno. Today, cross about those. Stealthy boy. O, patrz jaka rybka, tu patrz. O, zobacz, widziałeś? Patrz! Zobacz, zobacz, zobacz! Ona myśli, że jest wieloryb. Whale watching. Oh! 
What a beautiful view on this road here.
What the heck he's doing? <laughs> okay. More luck on the way down. Not exactly. It's always it's much easier to climb it than going down. And this is a part three of our British Columbia adventure. And from here, in this episode, we started our journey on this day from Owl Creek Recreational Site near Squamish. From there, we headed to Whistler, British Columbia, where we had a late lunch. And then we went through Vancouver and stopped for a night at Maple Ridge, visiting friends of ours. In the morning, we have traveled through Spencer's Bridges and another night in Anquala Recreational Site. to Vancouver after having a good chow everybody's happy and ready to continue on our great trip <laughs>
przejedzie przez wysepkę i będzie jechał za tobą, nie? A zobacz jaki drwal stoi z siekierą. It's a mine. I stoi taki mniejszy od tego, co w Sparwood. Horseshoe Bay is 30 k away. Oh, I have a feeling we're gonna get into the rain. Or it's just maybe just a fog. Normal weather day in Vancouver. Horseshoe Bay Village. Tutaj pisze na Wexit, gdzie wjechaliśmy. Kurde, jak tutaj zapikowane. So we made it to Horseshoe Bay. Scuba divers are present. You can't uh, in a public. Na lewą pas już jest. Jaki to jest speed limit w ogóle na tym moście? Eighty. So we left Vancouver and passing through a gold rush town. It's called Yale. Tunnels in the mountains are cool. Back to the better scenery than uh, the Vancouver city itself. And following the Fraser River down below, there is a second tunnel. That's a short one. Hell 
Hell's Gate Tunnel. Broken road, Canadian tax dollar at work. That's a tight corner. The, you, the whole thing starts glowing. Sure, man. Turns for monster sausage. Another night. Another night. 